and welcome to week one of Chem 2000. I'm excited to be here. I hope you are too. This is going to be a video uh, uh, covering all the materials about week one and any updates or changes that we've made. Um, and uh, for example, uh, updates for this week is that I have moved the lecture outline date uh, for both of the lecture outlines that are due back one day. So um, that'll give you one extra day to look at that material. Since the bulk of the material uh, that you're going to be doing in week one is going to be the lecture outlines, uh, I thought I'd give you one more day to do each of them. Uh, the earlier you do, you do it, though, the better. And as far as lecture outlines go, what you want to do is you want to have the lecture outlines that I give you, and you can either print them out or write the material from the lecture outlines on separate pieces of paper and then watch the videos and write down all the notes. And your goal should be that uh, in two weeks, when you look back at these notes, you should be able to understand and review for the exam that's in week five. So you don't have to write everything down, but you're writing most things down and you're doing, um, you're showing your work when I show work. Uh, now there are also companion problems and companion problems will do not have to be completed. They are up to you if you want extra practice. And so they are not part of your grade for the lecture outlines. Uh, in fact, a great idea is to just write CP for companion problem next to them. Uh, that way I know that you know their companion problems and you've skipped them on purpose. But if you don't do that, that's fine too, because I do know the companion problems pretty well. So those are the lecture outlines. Um, other things to do this week are um, you have class at 5.30 on Thursday night, uh, August 26th. That will be from uh, starting at 5.30. Please do come on time. Uh, we'll go over a number of things about the course. You'll pick up your lab kit and, um, and about how the lab works, about how the course works. I'll be there to answer any questions. I'm actually looking forward to uh, meeting you all. And uh, we will, of course, all be wearing masks. Um, but uh, still, it's an opportunity to be together and to talk about chemistry. And I'm excited about it. Now, homework one is due Saturday night at 11.59. It is a significant amount of work. You should leave several hours to do it. Uh, I suggest that you do re uh, watch and take notes on the lecture outlines, then do the homework. Um, and really, that's uh, most of what you're doing this week. There's no recitation assignment, and there's really no lab. Um, those start in week two. Uh, I say really no lab. There is a lab safety quiz that's due on Sunday, and there is a discussion board where you introduce yourself. That's also due on Sunday as well. Now, um, and I think that's most of the content that you're going to be having this week, and we'll talk more about it Thursday night. Uh, in class in uh, Chesapeake Hall 307 on the main campus of PGCC. And uh, when you're introducing yourself, there are some things that you have to say, and you'll see it in the prompt for the discussion board. But you might, uh, I'm also happy to add other things. For example, in this video, I'm going to tell you a fun fact about myself. That is that my favorite color is green. I've chosen to wear uh, one of my favorite shirts today uh, for the first day of uh, class. Uh, I, I didn't lay it out the night before like I used to do in um, elementary school, but still, I'm, I'm very comfortable in this shirt. So, uh, Looking forward to seeing you Thursday night. Uh, please plan on coming to any office hours. Uh, office hours are noted on the Start Here page and uh, with Zoom links. So, and looking forward to seeing you Thursday night.